So, all right. With that last run, Slug C down, we are at seven in a row, my friends. So, that is two of the three Slug ships down. Let's random she with the, she what the next ship is. Here we go. Random ship in three, two, one, and random. Oh, God. All right. Fed C. Let's get it out of the way. We had Slug B last last week and fed C now let's get the crappy ones out who boy let's see so um let me check my requests i have plenty of mantis requests i know try to do these in order no lanius pilot on this ship um fed a human i still haven't done uh but this is not fed a let's see stealth b pilot no Mantis. Average 650 wanted to be a Mantis. Alright. Average 650. Okay. Um, check that off. Uh, boarding Mantis. Okay, well that is a boarding Mantis, but the Mantis is already taken. And a rock on a rock ship. So most of the other ones are other Mantis crew. Okay. Human Grima. All right, we can get the human as Grima here. What kind of artillery does this ship have? Basically, it's a Flak 2 that's slower than a Flak 2 that you can't aim. This is one of the worst ships in the game. This dickhead killed your last streak. Okay, well, I hope it doesn't do that to me, but I wouldn't be surprised if it did. Betsy is one of the worst ships in the game because... It has two anti synergistic systems in teleporter and artillery. And it just has artillery, which is the worst system in the game, so. You want to be one of the Zoltans? Okay. And another Zoltan named Battery. Okay. I think that's all of them. Battery and... Moxitoxa. Okay. Uh, Sarpro, they've already been taken. I'm sorry, you're a little late. Remind me when we get another crew and I'll try to get you in. One thing we do have to remember is we can have safe fights against ion ships. Not that those appear that often if I move both these guys to shields. Um, we board with these two crew because boarding with Zoltans is stupid, even though that's what this ship is probably designed to do. Is there a reason why you don't have chat on visible on stream? Yes, I don't like chat on stream. I think it's very distracting. I only have it on stream when I'm on the break screen. Uh, is this the end? Is the end intended for this ship Zoltan bombing? Probably, yeah. Ship is bad because if, say, just hypothetically you fight a ship with combat drone plus heavy laser that is also a pirate ship in a nebula with upgraded doors and med bay, you can't board them or disable their weapons. And this is very bad. Yes. Okay. Can we get in here from the back? Giggity? No, we can't. But we do have 10, 11. We have 11, 12 if I go through two nebula jumps. Yeah. Oh, is distress speaking good? If it's um, giant alien spiders, yeah, I guess it is. I heard you like Flak 2, so we gave you even more Flak 2, but slower, and you can't aim it. Thanks. I would love a free crew. So instead, we get 5 free hull damage. Thanks, FTL. Go F yourself. Let's uh, repair with our Zoltan, since we're going to be venting this human and mantis over and over. You know what? You know what's better than this shitty ship? Is this shitty ship with a 5 health handicap. Thanks, FTL. Thanks. Let's start with a 5 health handicap, because the ship is not terrible enough. Uh, you guess chat visible is nice for the YouTube people? No. No, I do not like it. People ask. Uh, not that many people ask for it, but if you want to watch the stream and have chat, just watch on Twitch. It's literally... All you gotta do is literally watch the VOD, and it has chat on the side of the... I don't want it on the screen. I don't want, you know... Right here where the ship is, a bunch of chat covering the enemy ship, or 
down here where our power is. It, it's just, it's so distracting to me. I'm not going to have chat on stream. Sorry for anybody who wants that. All right, do we keep emergency respirators or do I sell them at the store? Something worth noting, because of the stupid smart target bug with artillery system, the best way to redirect shots away from shields and onto the artillery is to actually depower artillery. Okay. Check the VOD. There you go. Check the VOD. Uh, it's not dead end. I can go one, two, but then I, and then I can go three, four. Actually, I can do that. Um... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then ten, eleven, because we've gone through two nebulas. Actually, there is a really good route here. Okay, let's go that route. Come back to the store. Hopefully, we won't die before that. You don't like selling respirators at all, huh? Okay. Will I bring back song requests? Yes, I would love to get my stream muted. Ugh. First fight is five free hole damage. Second fight is Zeltan Shield Missile Asteroid Field. I hate this game. Ah, they have an Ion too. Selling respirators for shield buffer sounds awful, huh? If you're watching on a TV, chat looks horrible on that. You'd want to see chat. Go use your phone. You also prefer YouTube over Twitch to watch VODs. Well, I'm sorry. If you want chat on screen, you're going to have to watch it on Twitch. That's all I'm going to tell you. Because I'm not putting it on my screen. Yeah, there's no med bay. I think... Trying to decide if I've moved my two Zoltans to shields or not for the Ion. Yeah, I'm gonna move this the Mantis to sensor, see what we'd be boarding into. I guess I could put human in piloting while the two Zoltans are in shields. Rock and an NG, okay. How did you dodge everything? Oh, that was a first shot into my shields, okay. Do I board is the question. Oh my god. Do I board now this is down? I don't know if I should or not. Fucking hell, man. Fucking hell. Goddamn two damage missile this bullshit too. I can't even board if I wanted to. Wow. Fucking wow. Um I think our streak is over. I think it's just over. Unless I can get out. Fucking into piloting. Okay, we're not dead. Holy crap! Yes! Get me out of this shit! Get me out! Holy crap, we're not dead yet. Okay, alright. Um, all of my shit is broken, though. Okay, alright. Backtrack to the store. Artillery actually saved us there. All right, fix our ship. Maybe we're not dead. Just, you know, 21 fucking damage. No, minus five. 16 fucking damage first fight. You know. Because FTL is fair and fucking balanced. Yeah, yeah, you're far too late to wish us luck. We are instantly fucking so far behind. God damn it, I hate this goddamn shitty ship. Thank you for 500 bits, Fred, and 10 bits from earlier. Go back, how many more missiles can you have? 
Are you crazy? I literally just took a surrender to not fucking die. Are you crazy? Did you leave off the kappa? That's the worst idea I've ever heard. Uh, let me do this. What was the enemy crew? It doesn't matter. I took a... <laughs> it was in Iraq. I, I can't go back. I, I took a frickin' surrender. Why is everybody asking me to go back? I don't understand. Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay, frickin' hell. First jump was five free hole damage. Second was two damage missiles, ult and shield, and an asteroid field. First fucking missile went into shields, didn't it? What was the enemy crew? Uh, Zenji and Iraq. Alright, what do I do now? Like, do I go to the store, sell emergency respirators, and try to repair? I don't know what to do, chat. You tell me. Do I go to the store and spend 10 scrap on repairs? What do I do? Only silver lining is that repairs are only 2 scrap? True. Self-destruct, start over. Okay, well, that's a terrible idea. Thanks. Artemis missile and Fed Sea shield room. Name a more iconic combo. I think at this point, selling respirators for shield buffer and repair is needed, you think? Where did the health go? God damn it. Check the VOD! God damn it. Check the VOD, okay? Check the VOD. Look at all this stuff I can't buy. Uh, repair is the only way to save the run. Gotta gamble the RNG gets better, you think. Subscribe. Thank you for the get to subs, Tim Tam. Appreciate it. Well, we are effing far behind. Immediately. Can't get any of these extra jumps I was talking about earlier. God, this ship is so freaking terrible. So goddamn terrible. Yeah, where's the sector one free stuff? No kidding. Or just so far, I've had a store, a backtrack, free hole damage, an asteroid field, and empty jumps. That's been my sector one so far. 10 scrap. Good start. Good start. That's some fucking amazing weapons. And he's got three crew, doesn't he? I think this ship layout has three crew. Okay. Um, at least no heal bay, I guess. I think... Safety dance will kill him, but I'm afraid I'm gonna die to shitty, insane, overpowered weapons while we try to safety dance. And it's three crew and they're random types, so really? Yeah. Bye. <sighs> NG, that's a rock. Okay, maybe the rock is good because it'll slow down him moving and give us... Okay. Two NGs of rock is pretty good. Okay, didn't hit my shields. That's good. A lot of 2v1 time here. Actually, I'm going to finish this because this is going to be 2v1 versus the rock for a while. Okay, didn't hit my shields. Okay, we win this fight. How much damage do we take is the question. Wow, okay, that's a triple reward. A lot of damage for that triple reward, though. Ouch. A lot of damage for it. But hey, we're not dead. Look on the bright side, I guess. We're not dead. I think double board distracting shields and kill weapons is the play. Oh. Well, okay. Too late. I didn't do that. Yeah, whole repair drone. That's what we need. 
find a store and sell it to, I don't know, get something that doesn't get us killed all the time, maybe. That is enough for second shield, though, right? It is. So maybe we have some safe fights? Might have prevented some of the damage doing what you said. Most of it was going to happen anyway. I didn't see how many dodges I had, and so if I double boarded, I don't know if... I might have had some prevented damage by having my Zoltan stay and dodge, so I don't actually know. I can't even get this distress and get all my jumps, can I? So I do distress that gets me one less jump, or do I do all three jumps? And not get the distress. Fantastic Sector 1. Yeah. Right up until it kills us. Do I want one extra jump, or do I want a distress beacon? I've already seen five free hole damage from that madman trying to get free crew, I think. Dining lean spiders would be good. 50-50 on stuff and loose crew is not a big deal because of clone bay. If I have... If I fight a missile using auto scout. Depending on what else he had with it, we could potentially board him in the missile. On these other ship fights. Oh, gosh, I don't know. I guess I'm going to get the extra jumps. I think we should see more to try to stop, spot a store to sell the whole repair. I mean, if I spotted a store up here, I'd be diving for it. So I don't know how that helps us. Unless you mean like one, two, three, four, maybe. Could beeline it to the exit. See if that's a store. We see one extra jump. Oh, yeah, I guess you didn't know where the exit was. It's here. I could go to the exit and hope that's a store. I don't know about that play, though. Yeah, I know, behind my head. I can break an arty, which means Artemis, not artillery, if I port fires with them, huh? I'm just going to get the three jumps. Missile, okay. NG and a human, okay. Okay, Zolito, probably better. Gets two shots off, that should be it, right? We dodge, we dodge! <laughs> Every dodge is huge right now. Every dodge is huge. <laughs> Only one damage fight's honestly not terrible. Thank you for the 11 months of subage, Muhammad. One month away from the year. Awesome. Appreciate that. How is this even vaguely fair? Oh, it's not. FTO wasn't designed to be fair, it was designed to be a piece of crap punishing game. And I'm not saying just to be mean, although it may sound mean. It's literally the design philosophy. It was how punishing can the game be? Or how challenging is probably a better way to say it. Yeah, you need to be a good doge, that's right, be a good doge. I spend any scrap right now. What do we what do we need on the ship to not die? A store to sell stuff and repair, but like should I buy extra dodge right now to not die to missiles? The game was designed to be able to win 10% of games on normal difficulty. There you go. Will I take you out to for dinner on your subversary? <laughs> In your dreams. Seriously, you can you can dream of me taking you out to dinner, because uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know where you live. Engine three buys you one dodge at twenty misses. Enemy fires twenty missiles, you're dead anyway. 
if you don't think it's worth. So we save for a store, I guess. Probably hacking is how we win, but surviving to get hacking seems struggle bus right now. I think saving for store is better. Well, this might be the ship that kills us. It could also be free training. I don't know until I press this button. Okay, combat drone. If I get this offline, if I get the drone offline, we should be safe. Oh my god, he has a value point in drone control. Okay, okay, we're good. I don't have enough power. Well, not one my clone base going anyway. All right, keep keep the fight safe. Keep it safe. Keep it secret. Keep it safe. Thanks, artillery, for shooting my own crew in the face. I appreciate it. I know, look at how good artillery is. Everybody is so good. Just... He's doing so much work. Uh, let's kill that. So we can't dodge our next artillery in 20 minutes when it fires. Oh wow, that repair timing was interesting. It actually looks just to get two damage down, that's cool. All right, zero damage fight is good. Ooh, and a triple reward. That's kind of low scrap. Fire beam is not super useful, but I will take a triple reward right now. Artillery's trying its best. It's not its fault it's bad. <laughs> I guess that's true, Artie's helping. Uh, it kind of saved our butts in the first fight, but then if the ship didn't start with flak artillery, it might've started with something that doesn't suck. Yeah, that's why when somebody said it saved us, I was like, sure. Sure. You don't think you've ever seen what? That reward? Can I be the duster you use to dust artillery's controls? You got it. Artillery would be better if you invested all your scrap into it. Kappa, lapa, 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 coal, 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 lapa, kappa, lapa, coal. Um, is it worth doing this? Oh, double, ham double hull damage on boarding you've never seen before. Interesting. Well, I'm assuming you mean without Lanius crew or Crystal crew or Mercy respirators or all the other things that could make that happen. Yeah, this is the second run of the day. Is it worth doing this? In case we get into a fight that's safe but has Heal Bay and three crew. Is this worth? If I to save you, win it anyway. Do I if... I guess if we wait for artillery long enough, the answer is yes. If I to safe and has those, you can just double... And has, the, and has those, you can just double board, distract, and break that bay. There are no early game problems that cannot be solved with four crew. Interesting, okay. Okay, this could be a double reward. I'm hoping this is a safe fight that I can train. Please be a defensive outside drone. Nice. All right, let's train. So what do I want to train here? Um, all the things. A repair drone, three humans, okay. Um, I'll probably just train all the things. Uh, let's turn off this. Turn off that. And... 
get some training going here. This sector that started out horrible has kind of turned around a bit here. It's 10 scrap in the first, what was it, five jumps or something like that? Probably even worth getting the Zoltan piloting training here. Please turn off the best system in the game. Good call. <laughs> Look out! They have a basic laser. <laughs> oh man, if I was, if I was um, stealth B, I'd be terrified. No, no, no. Wouldn't. Could have trained weapons, but I put power. Had I put power in weapons? No, oh, true. I could have. Could have trained weapons on this boarding ship. Missed opportunity. Let's finish shields first. Okay. Now, um, you on shields. You on piloting. You on engines. The Mantis is the one I'm least concerned about getting training on. And then lost all that weapon training in the Clone Bay. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna lose all this guy's training in the Clone Bay, but who knows? Maybe next jump we'll get a free NG and I can... Wait, free rock, and then I can have my human go back to piloting. I could pretend to train artillery. I don't know what that means. But the flex, Rand, the flex, yes. Flexing is what I need to do on this terrible ship. Not taking every tiny little advantage I can to not die. Don't worry, it's a human. He learns fast. They're so good because of how fast they learn. The best... The best ability, totally. Alright, so you on engines, you on piloting, you on shields. Just need to wait for a safe two shield rigor with a shield drone, then you can train weapons without any weapons. <laughs> wow. God, that sounds like a five hour training session. How many how many shots does it take to train weapons? 58 plus whatever level 2 is. Oh my god, I can't even imagine how long that would take even with speed hack. Can you train weapons without any powered weapons? Or with just artillery? You thought it didn't count because he's not shown as manning. Oh, that's a good question. Probably wouldn't actually be training, would it? Unless I had fire beam powered. So the system could be manned. Okay, there we go. That is training done. I'm gonna leave this open in case I get another time where I need to train. All right, three humans. Uh, we might as well use safety dance to only have to hopefully um, refresh one time. And by refresh, I mean clone, of course. Yep, that should work. Nice. Ooh, and a double reward to go with it. Nice. Nice. If you stick a Zeldin weapons, then it's manned, and you can get weapons training from firing artillery. Really? Does that actually work? Let's 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 test that. I've never actually tried that before. Oh man! Ha <laughs> ha! Look at that. You can train weapons with no weapons fully powered. You just need a. Stupid artillery, and it'll work. Amazing. Amazing. I learned something new today. Did not know that worked that way. Yeah, that's crazy. The things you learn when Mike Copley hangs out in your stream. Try with the fire beam unslotted just to see the manning. Okay. Okay. 
Training weapons with flak artillery sounds like one of the kind of things where you'd start wishing you had speed hack on and then realize you did have speed hack on. It was just that slow. Yeah. So he is manning artillery right now, which does nothing except get him weapon training. It doesn't actually speed up artillery. There you go, chat. There you go. Things we learn. Things we learn. Okay, so we're continuing to save, I guess. Feels weird to be sitting with 80 scrap and that and only have shield upgrade. Hoping for an early store, I guess. Artillery OP confirmed because of that. No, no, it's not. <laughs> Best system in the game! Oh, oh, can I have a repair? 15 hull repair and a reactor upgrade. Okay, we're in it! We're in it, chat. I don't know how we ended up with 15 missiles on this ship, but we're in it! We're in it! Okay. Um... I guess we go pirate, because I have no way to get through Zultan Shields, right? Now I want to just get a free small bomb, and I can't use any bombs because I sold all my missiles for that. But still, it's worth. Um, I think we got to go pirate here, right? Problem is, pirate's one to two stores, and Zultan's two stores, and we're trying to get hacking. Pretty good sector one. After the free hole damage and the second fight that almost killed us, it was great. Yeah, I feel like I just can't deal with Zultans, right? Zultan shield with missile is just... Zultan border police is just... Zultan bazaar is very bad, as already demonstrated. Oh yeah, I guess that's what was the ship that almost killed, killed us with a Zultan shield ship with Artemis and an asteroid field. True. Alright, one nebula jump gets us one extra jump, so let's take that. And start looking for our store for hacking, I guess. Pirate life for me, that's right. All good holidays are described like that. Well, where it starts terrible and then gets better later. Bam! The human training pays off. Let's go, man. Let's go. Now I got... Well, he's not fully trained. I did have to refresh him once. But okay, man, okay. Uh, I had a request for a boarding mantis. Um, sorry, you uh, Twitch people, but I had a specific um, boarding mantis request, and it is... God, I'm not sure if I can read my own handwriting. I think that's Charos, C-H-A-R-O-S. Let me get that mantis. Uh, Grima gets closer to the door of that pickup, that's right. Artillery is so good at breaking shield in two hours. Yeah. Alright, safe fight. He has a heal bay. How do I take out two crew with a heal bay? I think it has to be distracting distraction strats, right? I think it has to be run my crew back and forth between some rooms and then get a second group of boarders. Ooh. Let me just think this through a bit. And actually, I think I want to do damage to their crew slower, so... I'm gonna start the boarding with two non-Mantis crew. It's helping. Okay, uh, I was not paying attention to that. God damn the artillery. I completely forgot it was online. I completely forgot it was online. I will right, hit the weapons. I mean, great. Good job. It's fine. It's fine. This should work now, I think. Actually, I'm gonna... Fire ourselves a little bit more time. There it is. Okay. Now we're good. Oh, now I'm refreshing my human again. 
Okay, I did not do that, ideally. I did not do that, ideally. We didn't take any damage, but I refreshed my... Uh, maybe I would have always had to refresh my human. If... Look at that. All right, keep the damn artillery off, man. Just keep it off. Stupid, stupid. Nice work, Art Flak Artillery. You hit the weapons that don't threaten us in any way. <laughs> Believe in artillery. Every time you look away, something positive happens. You are unlucky. You have to sign off in 10 minutes. Oh, God. I hope you're right. So I can get a store if there's one over there. Come back around if there's not. I feel like spending scrap now. I can still afford hacking, right? If I do that. Yeah, I have whole repair to sell. I think I do this so I have the option to use fire beam. Put that already back where it came from, or so help me. <laughs> I'm just going to do that upgrade. Go, go full beam master. Yeah. Fire beam what? A shieldless auto scout? Um, turn on artillery and totally use it. I don't know. I just, I want to have... I don't know why I want to have that powered. I don't know. Safe fight again. I just want to have it on. I don't know why. The RD fire beam wombo combo. Alright, uh, let's see what else we're boarding into here. NG human. Alright. So, the same thing as before. Where we buy time. These guys. Practice with safety dancing, although it's not exactly safety dancing. And these level 2 heal bays on every shift was not ideal. There we go. Now we're good. need to be refreshed because you're going to get repaired or healed for 16. You do need to get refreshed. I don't want to refresh my people who are trained, though. Now you can really weapon strain with a real weapon. That's 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 the reason. I want to be able to weapon strain. That's my excuse. And I could have weapon trained here if I wanted to, actually. Yes, I could fire beam when the artillery hits. I don't know if that's ever going to happen. If there's ever a situation where I need to do it. There probably isn't. I don't know why. I just feel like if I had the scrap to upgrade my weapons to not be level one, I feel like I feel this compulsion that I should. If I actually find a free flak, I could use it or something. I don't know. I think there's a mod for it, but it'd be interesting if you could use your teleporter to kidnap enemy crew. You can. It's called teleporter plus mind control. Okay. That's a compulsion you share. If you get a safe fight against a shieldless auto ship, you can do science to find out how long it takes to kill one of the fire beam. There you go. Problem with that is... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you do shieldless, yeah. Uh, do I get extra jumps, or do I check this to see if there's hacking, and if it's not there, it gives me more jumps to go looking for hacking at a second store. I guess I do that now. You made a ship for kidnapping. Not sure if it's still in the box. It should be. I haven't taken any ships off the box. There it is. There is the hacking. Sell the whole repair. So I could get long range scanners. I could get level two hacking. I would like the long range scanners. Do I buy both drone parts? I'm probably gonna be pretty reliant on this, huh? Just get hacking two rocks and fire beam and the game is perfect. <laughs> there you go. Uh, Zoltan, Sh you know what? There you go. Zoltan Shield brought down by his fire beam. That's totally why I bought it. It's totally that reason and not my compulsion to upgrade my weapons. 
And now I can avoid the pulsar by having this. I'm going to buy the other drone part. I'm pretty sure we're going to be relying on hacking to help us deal with a lot of boarding shenanigans. Yeah, avoid ion storms. Immediate value right there. Okay, this is a safe fight. Cool. Let's see what we're boarding into. Mantis, human, NG. Okay. Fun with safety dancing. Good fight. Not very good reward, honestly. 17 scrap sector 2, is that good? I don't feel that good. This run is coming up. Millhouse! <laughs> Another Simpsons reference. Nice. There's an episode where he's like, everything's coming up, Millhouse. He's trying to make his name mean something positive. I feel like maybe I saw part of that episode once. Um, let's avoid ion storms. That's definitely what I want to do. At least we're good on fuel. True. We're not low on fuel on a boarding ship. That's nice. Seems like a pretty reasonable spot for scanners. Okay, well, would I rather go to a pulsar than an empty jump? With hacking and boarding. Now, a uh, pirate sector pulsar. Are there pirate disruptors that can have hacking and drones? I don't know. Let's just not go to the Pulsar as a silly place. <clears throat> my feet are wet, but my cups are dry. Everything's coming up Millhouse. It's where he's wearing flood shorts and his house floods. I don't really get the joke, not gonna lie. The joke is the water's not even that high, I suppose. Okay. Um, I will buy three fuel, I guess. Fairly cheap. Well, it's looking like all our jumps are empty now. <clears throat> Anytime a slight convenience happens for you, IRL, you like to say that quote. Nice. Wow. Every jump is literally empty right now. Wow. Well, maybe they won't be empty, but they're not showing ship fights. Okay. Not a safe fight, and he has a heal bay. I could hack heal bay. I could whack, whack. I could hack weapons board in O2, so they like have to fight their way through the weapons, and we lock them in the doors. Zoltan and shield is just a safe fight. Oh, you're right. You're right. Good call. There it is. Thank you. So I don't even need to hack if I. Well, what are we boarding into then? It's two crew. All right, so I could run my mantis around and then send my human to the heal bay, I think is what we do here. This should be safe, I think. Trying to do not too much damage to them. I hope it's not another level 2 heal day. It's another level 2 heal day, damn it. Alright, that should do it. Okay, beautiful. 
All right. Whew. That's pain, but there we go. Worked. Poor human. I keep sending you over to board when you're supposed to be my Grima pilot. I need you to refresh, though. We'll hold the power of artillery fire beam. <laughs> we haven't taken damage since we got it online, chat. It's so good. Could have weapon trained. Uh, yeah, I guess I could have, huh? I'll keep missing out on weapon training. Who would I train on weapons? Honestly don't know who I'd train on weapons. Grima's job is to be vented for the good of the ship. True. The old arty fire beam combo. Damn, if I go to that store, I'd be gambling on this being a dive. One, two, three, four. All right, I'm going to knock out of the store, not gamble on a dive when our run's looking like this. Who to train on weapons? Gary Oldman says, EVERYONE! Is that a reference to... Fifth Element? Does he say that in Fifth Element? Alright, so here is a potential training ship. He has Clone Bay. So we get their border low, then we get their second border low, then we run around and kill Clone Bay, I think, is what we do here. Leon. Is that the movie with a young Natalie Portman? Okay. Let's see what else we got over there. Two NGs. How am I gonna do this? I could hack the clone bay, but I don't want to. I guess we let the second guy come over too. I feel like getting this kill without accidentally killing this NG is going to be a bit of a pain. Okay. Uh, performance breakout, performance alongside Jean Reno and Gary Oldman. Yeah. I can't remember if I actually ever watched that movie all the way through. All right. Um, okay. I think I'm actually going to send both Zoltans over for this so they do less damage to the crew when they accidentally hit them. Move them here. Take power out so my weapons don't go offline or my other stuff. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. All right, it's fine. It's fine. All right. All right, that worked. <laughs> uh they killed that fast enough. Uh, let's see, they heal for 16, neither of you will be full health. We just get a free Pegasus, so that might actually be worth getting online to kill clone bays and stuff. Uh, you watched Leon when you were a kid, barely remember anything though. Brother Leon is like a cinema staple, it's important to see like Alien, Terminator, and Star Wars. Never seen all of Alien, seen most of Terminator. Uh, you didn't mention, like, Godfather. That's probably on that list, too, right? And I've not seen Godfather. It's also directed by the same guy who directed The Fifth Element. His name is Luc Besson. Interesting note. Yeah, I've, I've watched some YouTube videos about that director guy. All right. So I probably... I probably do this. That is probably worth having to kill clone bays and stuff. Have that option if needed. Probably Shawshank too. True, true. Yeah, I'm. I think I have seen Leon. I just don't remember it because it's been so long. I remember very small things about it. 
Okay, he has a teleporter. Let's deal with the teleporter, and then we'll board him. He's got no heal bay. Deal with the teleporter. Deal with the boarding. Good dodge. Single missile, double fire. Man, that's a one fight, though. We should be good. Good dodge, man. All right. Whew. Oh, man, look at these rewards. Man, I was sure our run was over on that second jump. The five free hole damage into the asteroid field shenanigans i thought this run was over and now just look at us we're on the way to a full flackening with a flak two and a flak artillery the flackening begins that's right yeah, but don't get cocky we could still easily die to stupid shenanigans what do we need to not die probably level two hacking would be the next buy luke Besson kind of fell off the map after his valerian movie bombed yeah Yo, dog, we heard you had a terrible flak. How about another terrible flak with your terrible flak? So you can flak while you flak. Get the hack two, so we have that option if needed. So I guess next would be looking for Zolden Shield bypass in stores or other boarding support if we want something besides Pegasus, like Reach 2 Bomb or something. Four flak twos, level four artillery, four flak borders. <laughs> I don't know what a four, what a flak border is, but I want one. Right, I don't want a cheap Zeltan. Mantis or Mantis? We already have the build for Kazak, actually. Considering you can't get cloaking, you'd honestly consider just going hacking three and three power here, huh? Interesting. I feel like we need to always save to have Zeltan shield bypass money, though. Sleeping Dragon. I think. I think. We should make sure we're saving for that. Purple five looks tasty. Yeah, if this is our choice, it means if I go down this way, we don't have as many greens, but it'd probably take a slug here for a Zoltan here. Let's go see if we can find Kazak. I feel like flak borders are either Lanius thematically or Zoltan because Zoltan bombing. Okay. And um, Kazak would be at a ship fight. Surely flat borders are just rock crew, huh? Instant Kazak? Damn. Yeah, that is a big giant missile. Right, we board before we shoot to pull the pilot. Most likely to dodge there, I think. Pop. Fuck you, Fuck FTL. You, you Fuck you, <laughs> man. There you go. Pegasus and Swarm Missile, the two best missiles because they are the curse missiles. <laughs> nice, nice. Pegasus and Swarm, best missiles because... Because past ran cursing. Square Missile OP. How disrespectful to not call him by his full name, Kazak Plef Killick. I have his name saved in my phone's clipboard. <laughs> so you can remember it now. Pegasus plus hacking packs a punch, yeah. Now it's finally time to get our revenge from all the missiles that have hit us over the years. Pegasus into your face! All right, so um, Zoltan Shield Bypass is 55. Is that correct? I think that's correct. Sell Flak 2 for it, I guess. Um, let's hold off. We do have a store coming up. Pry it open. I got Clone Bay. And he did get cloned. Poor guy. 
I feel like the FTL's animations are made for Michael Bay. Okay. I'm not quite sure I get that joke. Michael Bay like explosions. How does that how does that connect to FTL animations? Oh, wait, was that following Mr. Shogi's comment? In some alternate universe where someone would think about making an FTL movie, who would you want to direct it? Michael Bay, Zack Snyder, or Ryan Johnson? Oh, okay. Well, Ryan Johnson would ruin it, so... He'd want to subvert expectations, and how do you subvert expectations in FTL? You always win, never lose? I don't know. Maybe I would like that. If I don't get both quest and store, if I go to this jump here... I might be okay with keeping these drone parts for chance at Kazakir. Any tips for new players? Hacking is the best system. Um, for really, really, really new players, probably a tip that you're not doing is you're probably not pausing enough. Um, so off the top of my head, there's a couple. Let me wait till that door closes. And I guess I get a little extra training by attacking an empty room. Yeah. Let's um let's make use of these doors he's gotta get through and just get some bonus training here. While a bomb is not doing anything that we should be afraid of, I don't think. Unless he starts a double fire or something. Here we go. I'm actually farming fighting training right now. Not something I do very often. There you go. Mike Copley's got a beginner's guide. Check out Mike Copley's guide. There you go. Johnson, systems put on fire can't be repaired outside of a store. What? Alright, finish him. Good enough. You need Michael Dorn playing... Kazak, Ryan Reynolds as a human, and Dwayne the Rock, Rock Man. Okay. Yeah, listen to Mike. He's good for new player tips. Ran never pauses. He must be new at this game. FTL, the movie is 10 minutes long because they rolled Fed C. <laughs> yeah, let's repair stuff. I think learning timing of things was your biggest beginner learning thing. Weapon, shields, power, cloaking, hacking. Yeah. Learning how to time your weapons and stuff is very important. All right, let's refresh. To be honest, FTL the movie is using Kestrel A. I mean, the FTL the movie already exists. It's uh, FTL Kestrel Adventures, right? That already exists. Yes, in general, I don't auto fire your weapons. That's a good tip. And generally, you want to be shooting at weapons and shields, generally. But I don't know if the person who asked is here anymore, since they're probably checking out Mike's video. <laughs> Real breakthrough for you is when you learn to time cloak and hacking correctly. Yeah. Okay, well, the stress can't be Kazakh, so let's go back and get the store, because we could get basically Zoltan Shield Bypass, the main thing we're looking for, I guess. He's going to be running, huh? Clone Bay. How are we going to do this? Hack weapons, board weapons. Actually, I think I hack weapons, board shields, and then move to weapons, because I think that might pull the pilot. Oh, come on, Has that man. pulled a pilot yet? 
That does not public pilot. It's still charging. Why is your FTL charging? Why is your FTL charging? Okay. Oh, I fucking hate this fucking game. <laughs> That's a double fire. I think I need to board again, actually. Time to board again. I just wa can't wait till I can board again. Get to board with, with my friends. I just can't wait till I can board again. Very nice. I'm bored again. I just can't wait till I can board again. Um, FTL the movie, first jump shield hack. <laughs> I paid full price for this movie and everyone died in the first five minutes. Um, you still mess up times, e.g. upgrading cloak when being out of sync with enemy missiles as you don't know the reload times. FTL could make a great movie universe though. You got the races, we got backstory. You could make five movies out of easily. Buying crew at store might need some work, though. Recruit in bar by buying them drinks. I swear, by I buy swarms just for this. Is that John Denver? No, that is, um... Oh, what's his face? Um, on the road again? Willie Nelson. That's good old Willie Nelson. Let me show you my wares. Points at slaves hooked on the walls. <laughs> okay. All right, store. What you got? Reconstructive is interesting. Fire bomb. I don't think any of this is good for our current build, right? Buying a whole laser one probably doesn't do us much good. No, firebomb. We have the crew killing build, and we have Pegasus, and we have fire beam. What do we need a firebomb when we have the better version in the fire beam? What about automated reloader to make Pegasus charge faster? Your crew here. There's crew. Is Hermes better than Pegasus? It's faster. It gets shot down by a sink by defense drone. This at least can get by one defense drone. One missile can get by. Well, is it okay for Zoltan Shields? Not great. True. Zoltan Shields. I don't have the bypass. I think I sell Flak 2 by Whole Laser 1 in case we do need to get through Zoltan Shield. I think that's probably the best thing here. Automated Reloader is... I'd rather just have crew manning weapons to get it than get an auto reloader for that. Reloader is for Artillery, Flak 2, and Pegasus. All massively benefit. Uh, I'm not really relying on the speed of that. I could see it a little bit for Pegasus, but Flak 2 and Artillery, are you're, you're making me like it even less. I think I'm going to do nothing else. This is a Mantis, so we have a chance at one more store. I think I just went Dodges. Honestly, the Hack 3 that Sleeping Dragon mentioned is not that either. Time to crew kill with Fed Seagull and Fire Beam. Sensors 3, that's the buy. Honestly, what I wish this store had was backup battery. That's what I wish this store had. I think Hack 3 just makes this fight, everything about this ship, so much safer. Let's just go ahead and do that. Still hoping for Gazak here. Nope, no Kazak. Double burst laser two though. Okay. Should pull the pilot. Oh, fuck you, FDL. Fuck you. Nice. 
I agree, Past Rand. I agree. Alright, they should run once they get low. You follow him. There we go. That should be GG. Good fight. Nice double reward. Beautiful. Nice double reward. I feel like I'm getting better at my boarding micro and manipulating crew, but it always feels good after we're through the hard part of Sector 1, it feels like. Engine 3 and TP2 are also good upgrades soon as you think. You had such doubt in the run with battery, you are saddened. Um, it wasn't because of battery that thundered. It was because of the rest of this ship that sucks. <laughs> Don't worry, I don't doubt battery. I doubt the power of this crappy ship. That's what I really doubt. All right, so um, let's go engine power. Maybe teleporter too soon. Soon, TM, soon. I'm, I'm hopeful we get Kazakh with, uh, Zoltan sh with the uh, long range scanners we got. Still no luck though. One missile, one drone part per fight is not too bad. It's currently the... Currently the... Uh, pace we're on here. I should pull, pilot. Hopefully he doesn't dodge. Fuck you, oh, FTL. You, FTL. Fuck you. Fuck you. That's <laughs> so many F-balls. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Why does Pegasus have so many F-bombs? Where's RPG so we can ask him? Wow, that is bringing their health down super fast. They might actually go back to the heal bay faster than I want. Okay, that's fine. That's stuck in there anyway. <laughs> just in time to die in a fire. I got through that door just in time to die in a fire. Well done. Okay, he will be fully healed. He will not. Battery's luck will power through anything, lol. Uh, good pun, good pun. I'm sure Pie Boy and Shogi will approve. The F Barrage was launched. Yes. Imagine Pegasus just uses the same sound clips as Artemis, but twice. Yeah, maybe so. Okay, don't go to the solar flare. Six, five, four, three, two, one. You don't die, at least you get insulted by quadruple F bomb. Yeah. Still no Kazakh, huh? Okay. Well the level three hacking is definitely showing its value with all these ships that have pretty darn good weapons. Oh no teleporter this time. Um Shitty fucking game. <laughs> that was a quick one. All right. Uh, damn, they made it into the heal bay. All right, that's fine. Could be fine. <laughs> that was really fast. Oh, that was a speed, speed cursing. Quick and ragey. That's right. Free repair, okay. Getting a lot of double rewards, man. Chance for level 3 hacking of Gondor to show his quality. I'm running a little low on missiles here. Pastor Andrew was screaming what the crew on that ship was thinking, huh? We need to suggest to RPG so that he makes a slightly change the pitch so it feels different. Uh... I feel like that's suggesting to me you should edit your videos more on YouTube. It's like, sure. Sure, suggesting it is just like adding more work that might not actually make for that much different of quality. I don't I don't think that's probably going to be needed. Three, four, five. Um, okay, so we do have a store, so chances of shield bypass. Have I considered getting more views? I know, that's it's a good suggestion. Got it. Nice. And we have a safe fight, so don't even have to use 
uh, hacking or... I mean, uh, yeah, hacking or missiles if I can help it. Alright, so kill the crew first. And then we use... Oh, he did get back, damn it. I don't want to do this. And if I had one more weapon power, I could hold, I could hold laser plus fire beam for the crew kill. Okay, this one should work. This should work. That stun uh, thing is annoying. All right, so I think I need to do some running around shenanigans again, don't I? It's double mantis. How do I do this without using a missile? Full health human and the full health mantis, and then I board with this guy secondarily, I think. That human's gonna get hit a bunch as he's slowly running across the ship, I feel like. I'm trading my human's piloting training for a missile and or drone part. Got it. GG. Do we win this fight? Oh, nice. Quickly, teleport additional crew for survivors. Quickly, give the clone play to save him. Your haste has paid off. The best reward in the game is yours. Kazakh, Mantis Pheromones. That's high scrap. Okay, maybe for sector four or whatever. And then a quest marker with a free weapon. God, I love that quest. God, I love it. So stinking good. And we probably put Kazak on weapons since we have two borders and I don't want to refresh Kazak over and over. Oh, is this only Sector 3? Oh god, it is only Sector 3. So I guess that is high scrap reward for Sector 3. Okay. I know we're rocking on this crappy ship. Don't get cocky, chap. Don't get cocky. Just like me. Don't get cocky. Okay. Um, see if we have a Zoltan Shield Bypass, so we'll have everything we need for our boarding ship. Man, you're just trying to jinx me now, aren't you, Mr. Keys? The other thing I want would be backup battery. Backup DNA bank, that makes it safe as well. Gimme, 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 gimme. Nice. Do I buy an NG? Probably not. Do I buy any missiles? Maybe. Don't get cocky, get Randy. <laughs> Let's grab recovery arm. I mean, we're so far ahead we could, but I'm not doing it. Any reason to buy NG for, like, blue options or anything? Buy scrap recovery arm, then sell it immediately to a certain dominance. <laughs> I'm going to do this so I can swap over to whole laser fire beam... In case we ever need to do that. I could still sell a weapon for... Actually, I, I would need to sell a weapon uh, for a... Salt and Shield Bypass. So that's kind of the only thing we really need. I'm going to buy two missiles, I think. Pegasus is doing some work for us right now. Scrap recovery arm for the blue options. Oh man, what a... What a play. What a play. Thank you for the follow, uh, Briubi. I missed that a couple minutes ago. Appreciate that. He has a bomb. He has a heal bay. I'm going to actually just hack heal bay here, I think. Oh, 
Okay, I'm taking damage because of my greed. Fucking fuck you! <laughs> Alright, there we go. He only had two crew? Or maybe one of them died to the heal bay hack, maybe. Okay, you... 16... Don't need to refresh, you do. Okay. You guys repair. I'm trying to not use a missile or... No, I already used a drone part. I'm trying not to use a missile there. Two must have died in the med bay. Okay, I was going to say, that was weird. Expecting another crew to be trying to get through the shield room door or something. But yes, I guess I did let two through and we killed them. Yeah, okay. So I feel like the only worry now is running out of consumables. So that's why I need to kind of maybe get some other weapon that doesn't use missiles or something. You just did manually search and you run it. It gave you scrap, a Zoltan, and an auto reloader. Holy quadruple reward. Rand murdered so many crew, he's lost count. That is a pretty accurate description of what just happened. Yay for free stuff, man. All right, Zoltan or Nebula? Uh, I think that's a pretty easy choice of Nebula because we have long-range scanners, right? We have plenty of fuel. I will say ship fights in Nebula, it's a bunch of auto scouts. would be a pain. But should be safe with hacking. What happens if you complete the streak? <laughs> Hot tub stream. No, not that. Uh, I probably take a break from FTL and then come back and do other challenges eventually. Never play this effing game again. No. Nah. Only if I ever find another game that as many people will watch me will I stop playing FTL, which hasn't happened yet, so. Whew, we almost could not get that. I think we can barely get it with two nebulas delaying. FTL trying to screw me out of my quest there. All right, um... Supporting auto ships is completely safe because DNA bank? Yeah, yeah, I guess that's true. So, what am I actually worried about then? Asteroid fields with... Double offensive drones or something? With Zoltan shield, maybe? Hitman Freelancer have to complete the streak? No. No, I want to play new games. I have a list. Spider-Man, uh, Miles Morales. I have, a, I have a list. I have a list of things I want to get to eventually. Make this fight safe. That's a lot of weapons. I'm a little afraid. Fuck you, FTL. Nice. Fuck you. Good, now we're safe. Many games I want to try on stream that I haven't gotten to in a while since I've been so focused on streak and stuff. I will probably eventually do what you suggest, uh, the Hitman thing, but it's, it's been too recent that I've played Hitman. I don't feel the draw to play it again yet. Uh, temperature and hot tub increases with damage to ship taken. He has to spend an entire stream dropping constant F-bombs. Would a hot tub with sufficient ice just become a tub? The past missile ran gets you every time. Nice. Last epoch. Well, that comes out tomorrow. Um, but tomorrow I plan on playing a little, a little while before having to leave early for my, um... Leaving for my gig that I have on Wednesday. So, as much as I'd like to play Last Epoch, I'm not sure if I'm going to play it on stream yet. And if I do, it would probably be on Friday a bit. Okay, quest coming up with a free weapon. Again, what am I afraid of? I'm afraid of lots of lasers and I can't get his weapons down. So just... Shields 3, do I have stuff to sell at a store? I I do. Go ahead and just do that. Maybe I don't have to hack every fight if I do that. 
Have I heard of a game called Cobalt Core? I have not. Way too late on this. There's a fire somewhere, and I don't know where it is. Be nice if we finish the fight before the missile. Nice! Oh, the hacking lockdown is so good. Hacking lockdown is so good. I only took the one missile because I couldn't micro my power around enough, or quickly enough. All right, we're going to work on the breach in here with my two guys I'm venting anyway. If they don't finish repairing it, I'll probably get level 202 so I don't have to vent anybody else for it. Yeah. Okay, there's no store. Um, a heavy ion would be huge here. I already got one and sold it. So, oh, you're trying to make me get bad rewards by making jokes, I guess, is what that is. We sold a heavy ion already once, yeah. Uh, you can throw me a Steam link if you like. It's an A, it's a, it's AA sci-fi roguelike deck builder game. Cobalt Core. I might have seen it. Check if it's... Before you send me a message, check if I have it on my wish list, if you're able to check that. I think you can look at my wish list. Because I feel like that sounds vaguely familiar, like I've seen a game that has that description. Because that description sounds familiar. Damn, wish I had more missiles. Well, actually, I can't sell my missiles. I have Pegasus. It's not. All right, if you want to give me a link, I can check it out later. Uh, Hermes, the other good missile... Or boarding, okay. Alright, well, looks like we just mainly need power right now. Seen a few streams of Cobalt Core, looks interesting, okay. It's faster than Pegasus. It's worse against defense drones, better against not defense drones because it's faster, I guess. Whisper Synth. Okay, cool. I'll probably check that out tomorrow. Thanks. Uh, they have more crew, don't they? Yeah, there they are. Because, uh, go murder them with your murder, murder mandibles. Alright, probably safe fight, but... Vent every time. It's interesting. Cobalt core sounds like a mix of a mix of armored core and there's a streamer that plays Binding of Isaac that I used to watch a ton called Cobalt Streak. Sounds like a combo of that for some reason to me. New teleporter sound. Go murder with your murder mandibles. <laughs> Yes, there you go. Soon this game will have no actual FTL sounds. It will just be all Rand-isms. How annoying would that be? All these empty jumps. All of them. Hmm. Okay, one, two, three, I guess. So half power. Not ideal. But it's a, if it's a auto scout, this is safe. It's not. It's cloaking with a missile. Fuck. Cloaking with a missile and a clone bay. God damn it. Uh, welcome, Average Chicken Song. 
You hope the Hermes has be has a B a good doge chance. Replace the background music with clips of you singing along to the various tunes that you do from time to time. Why am I using missile? Because we're a boarding ship, Caraborcio. What did you miss? Check the VOD. Would you be able to have a crew named after you this point in the run? Uh, I don't really want to rename Kazak, and he's the only one available. And I'm going to take the fight. It's only the missile online, lines. So I don't need shields. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that was fun. I can only use level two here, actually. Wow, I couldn't get a single Hermes off. God damn it! Fuck you, FTL. Fuck your shitty fuck fucking face. <laughs> oh, wow. Fuck. Okay. Damn. Messed that up. Damn it. All right. Well, that was a that was a uh, high passion one. What a shitty reward. <laughs> this is sector four, and I got fourteen scrap and a stun bomb. Okay, that was a really terrible reward. And uh, past Rand was really pissed at that one, I guess. Wow. Why do you have to be so mad? It's so late game. Yes, I was very mad. Past Rand was very mad. That was a really fast cloaking refresh, it, I felt like. Is Hermes really that slow, or did I take that long to power it? I must have taken that long to power it, trying to get my hacking over there and board and all the other micro. <laughs> Pass ran going ham. I could have moved Zoltans for power. Great, thanks. Uh, gives Pass Rand a hug. Okay. If I moved Zoltans for power, I didn't. I could have moved my shield, Zoltan. Move my engine, Zoltan, would have been good, because then I lose my dodge. Recovery drone, recovery drone. Man, they want to give me all of the arms, apparently. All right, well, there's backup battery. That's, that is definitely something I want. Um, I think I buy more missiles. What if I went whole laser 2? Whole laser 2 plus whole laser 1 for 5 weapon power could give me a way to... Do some damage without having to rely on missiles, maybe? So I probably don't want both of these missiles, so which one do I sell? Pegasus sells for more, so probably that one. Even though it gets by defense drones. The whole laser 2 buy, is that worth... I mean, the Ion Blast Mark 1 buy for Zoltan Shield maybe is better. Maybe the burst laser one. I got both of these. Be about the same as that. Just slightly faster getting through Zoltan shields. You prefer missiles over the hole too? I feel like Ion Blast for Zoltan shield m might be worth though. Maybe get the Ion Blast and a couple more missiles. Because the only thing that slows us down right now is Zoltan Shields to stop our instant boarding. Because I haven't found Zoltan Shield Bypass yet. And sometimes my plays confuse me because this is not what Pass Rand would have done. Buying missiles and an Ion Blast Mark 1. I, I have Fire Beam for shields. Yeah. I know, a bunch of mid-weapons, that's what we're getting a lot lately. Double missiles, okay. Nice, they're through. Missile those guys. God fucking damn it! <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay.
This is a happy missile expletive day, everybody. Happy missile expletive day. The old ion missile build gets them every time. Every time. Pass Rand is so angry. I know. I know. Pass Rand is so angry. Masterpiece. <laughs> All right. Uh. I dive if I go here now, All right? Yeah. Well, how many jumps do I have? I think I have five, actually. No one ever expects that build either. True, true. So what's my goal? My goal is Olden Shield Bypass. Probably weapon upgrades too, but let's work towards power first. Shame the distress could be a slug. Yeah, we could use a slug pilot, that's true. Board weapons, hack weapons, missile weapons. The tried and true strategy. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Come on, hit that guy so he's not shooting you at range, dude. Slightly slow on the micro there. Okay, we would have refreshed him anyway. Um, imagine how much scrap you'd have if you could tow all these derelict ships to friendly neighborhood junk shops. Yeah, no kidding. Where is real man? Real Rand, you are using missiles. Um, I am the real Rand. I am the final form of Rand who uses missiles and boarding all the time. I am become Hollow Shadaim. I am become him. Are my hands are pretty good. Pretty good. Wow, we're only Sector 4. Holy crap. I thought we were like Sector 6 or something. We were only Sector 4. Okay, three boarding. Um, not allow him to do this. Okay, good. Fight. No, I didn't mean because I have to tank that. That's fine. You go refresh. Rand is the raid boss. That's right. Rand is using chat GPT to win this run. You're playing normal mode, fed B, while watching, and you think you have your final weapons build already in Sector 4. Dual laser burst, two hull, one heavy one. Good build. Good build. Missile Rand equals best Rand Kappa. All right. This is based Rand, yes, whatever that means, I am that. Uh, it's probably an empty jump. I have 15 fuel. Just go one and out. Not waste fuel on a potential empty jump. Okay, this is a pretty safe, actually this is a completely safe fight. If I do this and they, mm, they still have some damage they can do. There's no heal bay, though, so... Let's see, we're... Mantis and NG, okay. That way, if we swap them out. Shouldn't you... The reason I'm saying all this is because I shouldn't need... to use any consumables. Very nice. No consumables needed. All right. Human with no training. Go be on doors, I guess. I just want to put him on shields so I can have the double Zoltan on shields. I mean, put him on engine so I have to have double Zoltan on shields. Meh. 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 Sure. I like double Zoltan on shields. Be cross training if we ever get some fights to train our human on engines. Apparently, ja chat GPT, when pronounced in French, sounds like K 
cat I farted. So whenever French newscasters were like, chat GPT could take over your jobs, they basically said, cat I farted could take over your jobs. Cool French story, bro. I like it. Apparently, Saucrolet has already redeemed to be a crew name. Uh, okay. Okay. Good. Thank you for reminding me. Perfect time for a human. I don't know if that's what Saucrolet wants to be, but... That was at the start of the run. Okay. Yeah, I think that was when... Uh, I didn't have any crew left. But thank you for that reminder. All right, slug. We already had level 202. Now, I will say boarding slugs is a pain. They have mic control. They have missiles and cloaking. Anything that makes it better. Level 2 cloaking, maybe. I mean, level 2, level two teleporter. You know what? Actually, I'm going to do this. Because this is probably going to be my secondary boarding party right here. Do that. Just being polite, moving myself up the crew naming queue. You can probably tell which country you're from. You're polite. So, Canadian? Certainly a lot of slug ships will be coffins, which are great for combat training, I guess. Do I need combat training? Not really, if that's refreshing him, but I guess we could train this human here. Human over here. So, looking for stores for Zoltan Shield Bypass. That's our main goal. Speaking of coffin ships, okay, this is the uh, medical system annoying thing. Do I need to hack his weapons? Yeah. Backup battery. Um, this is not safe. Okay, good dodge. Alright, so training then. So I could train this human in fighting. Seems pretty good. Okay, let's have you guys not train anymore. Train our secondary human in fighting. Am I really going to take the time to do this? Probably not. But maybe. These guys are both, both maxed. But what I could do is refresh them. Bring them back over here. Oh, wait. Uh, <laughs> we can't refresh them. That stupid thing. All right. Um... Weapon training does apply to artillery. No, it doesn't apply to artillery charge. But our uh, automated reloader does. Alright. Do I really care about slowly training this human if I use speed hack? Do I really care about it? Sure. I think our speed hack's still on. Okay. That's all the training I'm going to do. Uh, I saved my positions in a different position than I want them to be saved in, position-wise. No real risk? Yeah, yeah. Designing a ship with inaccessible O2 makes sense if you don't trust your crew. You think it's telling that it's a slug ship. True. Okay, there we go. And again, I usually don't use speed hack outside of early game training, but for fighting training, that might actually be useful on this boarding ship. I'm going to be okay with using speed hack once or twice on a coffin ship to get some bonus backup fighters. Uh, is it correct that three times reloader plus full something? Full weapon training is 50% improvement on max artillery. Uh, it's true that triple auto reloader is faster, but yeah, I don't think weapon training applies to artillery. Like uh, Semi-8 said. Okay, um, this, this, 
That is a lot of ships. Okay, no stores. So let's work on power and weapons. Anything I want that could be a value point that's useful against slugs? No, I don't know if there is. Imagine how insanely powerful be a pre-igniter applied to artillery. Definitely be better than the crappy thing it is now, that's for sure. Alright, this is a safe fight. Um, what's in their ship? Since we're actually not in this thing, yeah. God. All right, I'm going to... Man, I don't want to use hacking here. So it's a safe fight. Let's see how much dancing we can do that's useful. Does this work at all? Doesn't even seem that useful, but maybe. Now we can 4v whatever them. 4v whatever equals 4v4. Alright, good fight. Had to have Kazak take some damage. Uh, these are going to be really annoying fights with uh, 6,000 slug crew and our, our two-person boarding. That would be the only time you'd be happy to have artillery assistance if you have pre-igniter? Yeah. Sadly, it does not work that way, so I am never happy to have an artillery system. <laughs> Honestly, apart from Zoltans until I have Zoltan Shield Bypass, Slugs are probably the most annoying ships to fight for boarding because of mind control and how much? That six crew or whatever that ship had? At least five, I think. I think it was six. Maybe now I would prefer to have reconstructive. Um, you know what? I might actually want to start doing this. Full laser ion, ion blast fire beam with their weapons or shields hacked. Might make the fighting easier if I can get some systems like mind control offline and not have to use a Hermes. Although I have more missiles than I have drone parts. I don't know, we'll see. I'll try to conserve some missiles right now. Really good weapon system. Alright, let's... Yeah, we did steal five drone parts earlier too. Wow, yeah. Well, we can use the hacking to seal off the room though. We're gonna have to desync the weapons. All right, this is our drone parts with us. Fuck you, Kay. Stealing five drone parts earlier, not doing that other quest. It's crazy. Yeah, this looks good though. This should be fine. Just need to use the hacking weapons, boarding weapons, shooting weapons strategy. You mean I was gifted five drone parts? True, it was a gift. No re-gifting the drone parts. They were a present. You can't take our clothes. You gave us these clothes. They were a present. Name that movie, chat. Name that movie. Anybody name that movie? Uh, I thought of an amazing upgrade for artillery as a system. Letting it be replaceable. <laughs> Okay. Name that movie quote, chat. Uh, 121 scrap. Continue to get dodge and power, or do I want teleporter three? Dodge and power. Anybody? Can anybody name that movie? That was from Showgirls. Good, good guess. <laughs> Incorrect, but good guess. <laughs> 
Shogi would know. Shogi probably does know. So I'm just going to vent them. And not even deal with the boarding. Okay, I'm okay. Let's do it this way. Fuck you, man. Uh, you're half man, half dog. I have my own best friend. Name that movie. Uh, that one's easy. That's Spaceballs. That is Spaceballs. Super easy one. Something from Monty Python. That's a good genre guess. Correct genre. Of course, it's pretty easy to guess that that's a comedy. Alright, I don't think anybody's gonna get it. The one about the clothes thing? Alright, I'll give a, I'll give a hint. Steve Martin was in the movie. Is this Steve Martin is in the movie. Steve Martin didn't say that, but Steve Martin is in the movie. The jerk. No, three amigos. Tater's got it. That's three amigos. It's the quote at the beginning of the movie when three amigos are getting kicked out of the studio lot or whatever. Take the amigos' clothes. And uh, Martin Short says, "You can't take our clothes." You gave us these clothes. They were presents. Good job, taters. Good job. Well done. Real bullets? <laughs> That's right. Three Amigos. Such a great movie. We like to imagine every time a missile hits with the custom sound, it's the ship's crew saying that. Yeah, yeah. That's why you didn't get it. You haven't seen that one in so long. You need to watch it again so bad. I watched Three Amigos so many times as a kid. My god, I love that movie. Oh man, this sector layout could have been so good. Look at this. If this connected back here, we could have gotten so many extra jumps. As it is, this is going to suck. This is going to be a sucky sector. I can't get all of these jumps down here. Alright, uh, I don't even know. There should be two Nebula stores that I can still get, hopefully, somewhere. You're imagining Sergeant Bilko, huh? What is the airspeed velocity of an unladen swallow? All right, ask see the goods. Continue. Understood, and then forget this. Damn. If we had a slug there, we could have... Um, done something. One, two... Hmm... This, this sector layout so close to being amazing and now it's just kind of crappy okay hack weapons missile weapons board weapons dot 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 profit again with this many crew probably do how did you dodge nice everything? dodge if we go what? here we might end this quickly enough Let's not take another missile nice nice the extra boarding saved us from taking another missile beautiful 78 16 I need 84 I'll let you I'll let you not get vented one time and I will upgrade my that so you will be full health. Okay, uh, 25 will make you full health on the jump. I wonder if Shogi would have recognized the uh, Three Amigos quote. He probably would have. He probably would have. Okay, uh, 119 scrap. And I'm only in Sector 5. Holy crap. I can't believe with how terribly this run started, how strong our ship is right now. All right, store position's good. Okay, teleporter. All right, well, it's not a slug, but we get our uh, Zeltan that I was hoping for for the two shield protection. Told me this ship is a stronky boy. Yeah, yeah, this is totally really stronky boy. Totally. Totally. 
Okay. Um, I think I don't have to use hacking here. If I just board here, I'll hack if things get bad, but with how quickly we're going to kill this guy, I think we're pretty safe on this fight. Yeah. Wow, they really hate that human. <laughs> Get firebombed! I God, I hate humans. That guy needs to be vented. I, I agree with you, but it's rude. It's rude. I remember to insta-vent. Chat, I remembered. Do you need training again? Probably, actually, so... Get you over here to start doing that. Could you be the new Zeltan? Sure thing, average chicken song. Sure thing. Chicken is fine. All right. All right, so I'm going to speed up time for one last time to finish training this human, which actually, yeah, I don't even need to speed up time. It's going to go super fast. And by the time these guys board and kill that guy, he'll probably have the training back up. And it's done. All right, good fight. Do I need to refresh? Heal for 25 now. Mm, we're gonna be almost max health. I'm gonna agree to not refresh. And we have a store, so we have an extra gem. All right, Chicken the Zoltan. You sound delicious. I will be eating you tonight for dinner in a taco. Chicken the Zoltan. Okay. Wow, more missiles. <laughs> ah, I heard this guy likes missiles. Let's uh, let's give him some more missiles. You know what? It's probably worth replacing our pilot with a slug. I think it is worth. Um, because we're not going to have the mind control counter. We have two more sectors to find a free slug, but I don't think I want to trust in that. So I think it's time to vent a human. Grima... You've been great. You've been great. But, uh... I'm sorry. It's not you, it's me. We're outsourcing. We're downsizing. It's venting time. I think we had another purple. Well, if I get a, if I get a slug for free, it'll be bad for Grima. But... Space, get out. We're so far ahead that we're venting crew to get a slug in Sector 5. That's kind of ridiculous. Is there a subculture of mantis which try and cook Zoltans without making them blow up? <laughs> I don't know. That's well, not a slug, Nebula. Do I go Zoltan because two stores? I don't have the mind control counter. And I don't have Zoltan shield bypass, so I'm going to go Uncharted Nebula. Zoltan 6 sounds like a terrible idea. Did you know, fun fact, Grima is actually immune to venting. He will return. Nice. That's a good fun fact. I think you'd try food from a mantis chef, especially if it's the guy who thinks he's a human. Can the slug be renamed to Joe Rel? Sure. Just hacking. I don't think I know that reference, but... How did you dodge everything? What? What the hell? Okay. I would like to not use all my missiles just to not take any Why? missiles. Why? He dodged every fucking shot! Oh, I There's hate this Death by a thousand day. fucking missiles. Okay. Get back over there, I guess. Okay, I almost forgot to hack another time. Come on, get that down, please. Damn it. Fuck you, Kay! There it is, there it is. There it is, okay.
get some weapon training that we don't need on Kazak here. No dodges allowed. He's got level three. Uh, what you would call it? Level three piloting. Beautiful. All right, we're just waiting on artillery now as we slowly keep this missile down. Look, everybody, artillery's helping. These poor mantis losing all their training. That artillery we shot was so bad. I trust artillery so little I don't even check what artillery does, to be honest. Sure wish we had level 4 artillery. No, no, I don't. Not even a little bit. Alright, this might work. Um, Joe Rell is a World of Warcraft reference. He's a Karaji elite in the Barrens. Alright, cool. Sounds like something a mantis would be. Oh wait, a slug would be. A whole beam, eh? Okay. Take that. Alright, so it's supposed to be Joe Rell, huh? Artillery can feel like it's doing something. Yay, I'm helping. Do I want this on my bar? Does fire beam count as a beam for carefully cut the ship out? I feel like it doesn't. Our goal is stores Zoltan Shield Bypass, so I'm gonna... Skip this ship fight to reveal all the jumps. Game is guiding me towards Beam Master Race, huh? I guess it is. How long is artillery reload when it's fully upgraded? 20 seconds, unless you have um, automated reloader is speeded up. Let's get more dodges for the missiles that we don't have cloaking for. Overconfidence is slow and insidious, killer. True, true. We are so ahead we might even get max artillery if things go great. It's possible. <laughs> There's the free slug. Alright, who's my engines guy? It's one of these Zeldons, isn't it? Alright, well. More useful than a human. Get out, human! But I had training! And actually... You are engine trained. I could have engines and piloting fully immune to mind control. Do I want that? Have my Zoltans live in the shield room, maybe? Maybe I want that. Alright, no stores over here. Hope he trained in zero-g navigation without a spaceship. That human, yes, yes. Let's hope. Okay. No defense drone on this guy. That's good. Drop artillery here. Let's have a clone bay, though. Not as good. Fuck you, bad, you fucking bad. shitty game! Alright, my secondary boarding party not as strong, sadly. This is level 3 Kwame. This might be a challenge to finish off here. I think we're okay, though. They'll finish this guy, then move out. I think we're good here. Damn it, get that guy out of the way. Okay, actually stop me from attacking Clone Bay by being stuck at the door there. Hacking actually hurting my ability to crew kill right there for a bit. Get out! I'm trying to kill this thing. God, that is level 3 clone bay, isn't it? Jesus. Freaking finally, okay. There it is. Okay. Secondary borders, I'm going to not refresh. 
Uh, let's see. All the humans being vented into space clouds to make extra sure they won't be picked up. Yeah. Name that slug Sleema. <laughs> Grima got turned into Sleema. Okay, sure. Sleema. Is that like Zima? That stupid, fruity, uh, alcoholic beverage? I think that's a fruity, alcoholic beverage. For, for slugs? Sleema, the Zima of slugs. All right, well, I have nothing to upgrade right now, so let's get doors and piloting, I guess. Uh, if that's one of our stores, we're not getting it. Watch our stores be all at these dead ends over here. That proves the human slug same thing theory of yesterday. Okay. I have five drone parts left, man. I need to buy drone parts at the store. Ah, I just gotta keep packing weapons. I gotta just do it. I don't want to, but I need to. Pull the pilot, kill the weapons. And by kill the weapons, I mean kill those that were in there. And I was running out of missiles earlier. Now I'm running out of drone parts. And my missiles are looking fine. Okay, yes. Please go die in a fire. <laughs> Alright, or die in here. You know, I'm cool either way. Alright, we got a missile and a drone part. I like that. Uh, on WoW references, every human should be called Malfurion, considering how useless they are. <laughs> Poor useless Malfurion Stormrage. Fun fact, you share 98% DNA with slugs. Okay. Is that true in real life? I've heard like 97% is shared with like, I don't know, chimpanzees, or maybe it's even higher than that, I don't know. Alright, store, good. All right, let's check what we got here. Share 50% DNA with a banana. Okay. No Zoltan Shield Bypass. There's Reconstructor. There's a heavy laser. We definitely want to keep Fire Beam for phase one of the boss. Um, Heavy laser instead of something. All right, let's buy all three drone parts first of all. Man, maybe I want reconstructed here. We're so far ahead. Is there another store at non nebula jump? There isn't. Okay. Do we need it? We don't need reconstructive, but I can crew kill without a fire beam. I don't really need it. Um, will it make it easier? Honestly, I kind of just want to buy Heavy Laser, sell Fire Beam. I could like swap out Hermes and Heavy Laser for when I'm running low on missiles, maybe. Reconstructive saves training. It, it mainly saves time more than anything else. I don't have to refresh my crew every jump. Buy all three fuel. I mean, this. how do I want to win more is the question. How do I want to win more? Um, we could even get advanced FTL navigation for potential retreat, retreat strats in sector eight, but every time I try to make that happen, it doesn't really do much. almost have all of these weapons online all the time, actually. Almost. I bought all the drone parts. I bought all the fuel. Might just go towards weapon upgrades next so I can use Hermes with these other weapons if needed. Let's go. Let's just start investing into weapons some more. 
So it looks like if we do have a second store, it'll be up there, which I might backtrack for maybe if it's... Oh, well, it could be could be here. Exit beacon and one non-nebula jump right here behind my head. Heavy Ion and Chain Ion. Ion. If we had those to our flak artillery, we're set. <laughs> I'd love to see the tier list for the person who has all those at A and S tier. Reconstructive is very win more, yeah. I'm just, I can't see myself spending scrap on it, even though it's something I could do. I could do it. Does that pull the pilot? Not yet, but that does. There. No! <laughs> oh, the pain, the pain. Oh, past Rand. It's just a missile to the face. Why you gotta be so scared and mad and pained? Just a missile to the face, no big deal. Oh wow, he's just gonna kill himself at a fire. Thanks. Uh, your ex shares 97% of her DNA with Lassie's mom. <laughs> you mean a uh, a very nice dog? Okay. Uh, yeah, reconstructive fills up her augments, much like you with weapons. You really don't like being full. Yeah. I don't like. I I mean, what if we got a free pre igniter? And I'd have to get rid of long-range scanners. It'd be a good problem to have, but it'd be still a problem. We just, we don't need reconstructive. We just don't need it. You're mainly glad that your Zoltan gets to sit and chill in the shield room, supervising what's going on without actually doing anything. <laughs> Is that what you do at your real job? Admit it, that's what you do at your real job. Nobody here works. You're just here watching streams. And I approve of this message. Okay, good shield training means we're good. No heal day, so... I could let him board a second time. And maybe I will. All right, we're getting some training out of this, so that's good. Make sure we're safe and do a little bit of damage to the weapons. The dodges, though. All right, they should all be super low. And we finish them really fast as they run in the room. Looks good. Beautiful. Stoic past Rand. He did not hide the pain. You plead the fifth about not doing anything at work, huh? <laughs> Alright, that'll be half power. I currently have 15. Buy two, because what else am I going to spend this power on? You go hang out there for now. Prepare to fight. Poking. Um. Okay, we should be safe here. Shouldn't need to mess up any more training on these guys anymore, I don't think. Unless he repairs his weapons, which he might do.
Uh, this would be a good ship to have the uh, beam on. Alright, let's go board on his cloaking. It's taking too long. Nice. No more dojings for you. How long has a stream been on for? How much fun can we still expect? Uh, should be literally below the stream. I'm pretty sure there's a counter below the stream. But uh, I start at 11, it's a little after 3, so close to four and a half hours. Close to four and a half hours. Alright, distress beacon there. Would I dive if there was a store up there? One, two, three, four. Or it might not actually even be a dive if there's a store up there. I would have to dive for a store up there, so. There it is. Four hours and 29 minutes. Yeah, usually it's two hard mono pause runs, yeah. That is correct. Go fuck yourself. Oh, I've moved there. Piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, kill the clone bay. I thought his missile was down. Fuck you. Fuck you, you cheating ass game. Killer is down, that's vented. Finish this guy off before he gets in there. Refresh my dudes, that's fine. Should be no more missiles, very good. Actually, I'll vent you here. Vent you on his ship or my ship, doesn't matter. Yeah, the only time we'll do more than two runs is if the, the two, two runs go really, really fast. And the first run was just about two hours, so we could have potentially done a third run if we didn't roll. This horrible, horrible ship that is actually really really strong right now okay we don't have another store so let's just have all of our weapons online i like that still have a whole other sector worth of scrap to gain here it's crazy all right hail them don't have the zolden shield bypass double offensive drones Only three shots in total. We could take damage. Okay. Um, same strat, because hacking weapons here just locks down heal bay too well. Come on with these huh. fucking dodges, man. They can't put power back in while attacked, I guess. A lot of dodges, okay. All right, let's not use any more consumables if we can help it. Okay, good. Okay. Wow. That was a lot of Zoltan explosions. They actually killed all my crew with their exploding faces. <laughs> Tomorrow's stream will be skipped, correct? No. Um, I think I'm going to stream for an hour or two. Thankfully, it's a WoW day, so I can get a little bit done. I have a gig at 2. No, I need to be there at 2, so I need to leave by, like, 1.30. I should be able to do, like, my first two-hour segment tomorrow. But uh, I have a gig at 2, so I need to leave. I need to finish by 1 at the latest tomorrow, so... Uh, it's a Zoltan bomber, but not what you expect. Rand taking optimization to the next level. Totally. I actually don't want to give away my drone parts. Thanks for nothing. Civilian Sector 7. Let's go. Hopefully three stores at chances for Zoltan Shield Bypass. Man. 
literally value point in every system except backup battery. Well, and floor shield. At the beginning of Sector 7, this is crazy. Huh, that could have been a bonus store. Yeah, this is definitely going to be a floor shield run. 100%. 100% it will be. Dodge everything, please. Oh my god, okay. Did I get there before Glade Beam? Okay, thank god. I get there before Glade... Uh, I don't get there before Glade Beam, but thankfully... Thankfully, he did not, actually. Fuck you, game! There. Fuck you! One missile, one drone part per fight. That's the goal. Nice scrap reward. And we have a store. Uh, I could do another ship fight before the store. In case the store doesn't have what I need, I'm going to just go immediately to the store. So then I can check that and then back around. Okay. Not using the artillery beam at all. Why would I use the artillery? And it's not a beam. <laughs> there it is. Ultimate shield bypass. We are a boarding ship. We do not use artillery. Why would you want a flak artillery shooting at your ship while you're trying to crew kill their ship? Why would you want that? You don't. Um, drone parts. I do have uh, our, uh, explosive replicator, but I'm worried about missiles running out. Do I want to keep the Hermes? If there was a breach two bomb, I'd sell the Hermes. Artillery aren't. Yeah, sure. Um, I kind of want to stop using missiles. It's great for phase one of the boss. I guess that's true. Since we don't have cloaking, we hack the missiles and. Hopefully artillery, uh, Hermes the missiles and never take any missiles. Yeah, you're probably right. It's probably worth keeping for that. Maybe I... Hmm, yeah, I probably just hold on to it because of the boarding support. Alright, um, so we don't need stores now. All we need is scrap. So, into the nebula for all the civilian nebula upgrades. I guess. Yeah, bombs teleport through Zelton shields, that is correct. Although I guess I'd check a store for breach bomb. Yes. I almost did that too late. No! Killing this guy's clone bay. Alright, I'll use one more missile. Fuck you, FTL! Fuck your shitty fucking face, man! Woo! What the fuck? Woo! Okay, pass Rand, okay. Alright, we're taking shots here. That was uh that was a rough one. I can only imagine what happened to Pass Rand. That was, that was a really, really rough one. Al, Al, I can feel the pain. That was a spicy one. That's a spicy meatball. Yes, yes it is. All right, uh, free burst laser two, uh, burst laser one. Is that better than any of these? I guess it's better than ion blast, sure. So, we do have a store down there. Okay, we'll eventually go to that. Let's get force shield right now. I'm a little embarrassed by that outburst. I'm embarrassed for past Rand. Um, you just unlocked the crappy ship I'm playing right now. Congrats! I guess that means you beat Fed B. Congrats. 
Salt and spice, I know, right? Shots fired, yeah. <laughs> Literal shots fired. The missile into his face is what caused that. Literal shots fired. All right, into the nebula we go. Go around, down to store, then back up and around. Should make a lot of scrap this sector. You haven't beat it yet, but you made it to the last stand. Oh, yeah, you'll have to make it to the last stand on a ship to unlock the next one. That's right. Okay, I'll have to see what he hacks first, because if he hacks my hacking, it's fine. Shitty game. Alright, kill, kill this crap. Fuck you, you fucking shitty game! Triple frickin' missile shit, man. So balanced, so balanced. Okay, now you have none. Alright, uh, he's hacking. I need to wait for the hacking. I need him to not run here. Fuck you, yeah, FTL. Good. Fuck you, man. Come on. Finish him. Okay. Okay. Really annoying ship packing my teleporter and having triple effing missiles. What a balanced build. So hashtag balanced. All of the upsides of consumable offense, none of the downsides. What even are consumables? I don't know. This guy doesn't need them. All I needed was a freaking uh, drone control system, and he would have had max cheaty build by cheaty uh, AI. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine nebula jumps. And I need an even number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine, ten, eleven, something like that. We're gonna get a lot of jumps here. All right, half power, double half power nebulas here. Missiles are a timer on my sanity. Manly search. Okay. Ouch. Auto surveyor just dodged your entire volley of eight shots. Astronomical odds, they say. Astronomical odds. It's going for that one uh, achievement, right? We got five missiles. Yeah, that is good. All right, three borders. Time to vent. Beautiful. <laughs> Kill them right as they come into the room. So we're going into another half power jump. I think we should have enough, just enough for all that stuff. 34 scrap, what do we even want? It's all value points and power now, I think. Intruders on board. At least they brought snacks. Freaking same fight, I feel like. Uh, yeah, almost like damage, but we're getting it. it's good. All right, we're going into a ship fight. We are going into an empty jump that could be a ship fight, so let's refresh you. Oh, 
And then to a store where we repair and make sure we don't die to some stupid crazy OP ship in Sector 7. That would be a really crappy way to end this run after such a crazy strong bed sea recovery from a rough first couple of jumps. If you're so far ahead, you can swag your sensors and get even more swaggy artillery. I might just do that. Alright, non-stop frickin' borders, man. Non-stop goddamn humans on my ship. Could you get the hell out? Get out! Alright, two stores over there. Six... If we go through four nebula jumps, we get eight. So eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one, or three, two, one. So I don't see a ship right there. Let's go one, two, three, four, five. Actually, I don't. Hmm. I don't know if I can get all these. Is there a way to make this happen? Five. Six, seven, eight is what I want. Eight, seven, six, five. I'm not sure if I'll get that in five. We'll try though. One, two, three, four, five is what I want to have happen. Let's see if that works or not. Recovery arm, stealth weapons. Don't have stealth. Do I? Yes, let's sell. Ion Blast for Burst Laser Mark 1. If there's like a Burst 2 or a Flak 1 here, I'll be very happy. Not sure if I'm going to get all these jumps I'm hoping to. Automated Reloader instead of Long Range Scanners. Well, our path is pretty much set. So it would just be the long range scanner value compared to automated reloader value in final sector. So I think one of the few times I will sell long range scanners is at the end of the run when my jump's pretty much set and it's something that gives me more combat power. So we'll do that, do a little repair. I'll do my last weapon upgrade soon. Uh, you once snap bought stealth weapons on this ship because you love them so much, and then you remember that the flak artillery existed and you couldn't actually get cloaking. I, I was thinking about that. Thankfully, I didn't snap buy it like you did, though. And this guy has Zoltan Shield. I think this is the first Zoltan Shield ship we fought since we got Zoltan Shield bypass. I think we take damage here. Good dodges. Ah, stupid, stupid, stupid. Okay, we got one flak down. That's good. Okay. Ah, I fucking hate you, FTL. I fucking hate you and your fucking bullshit. <laughs> I could hear. I can hear Clone Bay going offline in the background of that one. Uh, <laughs> I know exactly what pissed off Pass Rand on that one. I could actually hear the re 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 re. <laughs> I wonder if that was from one of the recent runs. Was it last week when. No, it had to be before that one. If you're wondering what that Clone Bay sound was coming from, that was from the, the sound bite there. That was even scarier than a real re, yeah. <laughs> I think that was a pretty recent one. It might be. It might have been. Yeah, I don't think I get that jump. Badly. Alright, free stuff. Oh, we do get it. Calculated. Problem is, I don't think I get that in three, do I? One, two, three. Actually, I think I do. I think my calculation calculations were just barely correct. Mm. No. If this connected there, that's what that would have worked. Oh well. 
They're both, they're probably all empty jumps, so it doesn't really matter. Time for some Reddit engines? Yeah, even before I do more artillery upgrades. Okay, uh, hack weapons, board weapons, dot 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 profit. Pilot's right, gone. Fuck you, FTL. Fuck you, that. man. Come on. Missile is still online, though. Damn, I think I take this missile, unless we can dodge it. Fuck you, man. Ow. All right, another heavy laser for free. I mean... I'll never turn down a free heavy laser. What could I have done there? Missile to weapons, I guess. Think of how strong we would be without a 15 health, 3 jump handicap. Well, I will say we got a free 15 repair at the end of Sector 1, didn't we? That's what kind of turned this run around. We got a... We sold... We gave away 15 missiles and got a 15 hull repair. So... But we, I did spend a decent amount of scrap on repairs before that. I can't remember how much exactly, though. I don't even know if I can make use of that heavy laser. Sensors for 35. No. Even though we could get swag sensors, I'm not spending the scrap on it yet. Yeah, the whole repair drop we got. But let us sell and then repair our health, I think, a bunch. Well, that's isolated. That's pretty isolated. Ugh. Might not get any repair jump, uh, repair things here. I want max boarding. And then I want backup battery value point. And then maybe I'll invest more into artillery and power. Maybe. Probably not. Though. I spend about 15 on repairs, and didn't I buy missiles and store lighters? Yeah, I think so. Okay, how do I don't want to do this? Rebel rigor. It's got to be hack. Uh, if this guy has a defense drone, my Hermes does nothing. Okay, he doesn't have a defense drone. Yeah, crap. I didn't do that the whole thing. Fuck you. Fuck you, you cheating ass game. Okay, well, um. Got his missile down. Okay, missile's down, so we're gonna just play this slow. We're gonna take one damage from that. But otherwise, we're safe here. Okay, good. Uh, why did I send my Mantis over to repair that? I don't know. Uh, Swag Sensors doesn't work if it's cheap. Check every final boss fight. What? Oh, yes. Feels good to be in this position on a run that was a declared dead in Sector 1. Yeah, yeah, it does. But we haven't won yet. We haven't won yet. And we still don't have cloaking and hacking because we can't get both. So, n never take anything for granted. We'll be fine if I don't refresh it. But hopefully with Zeldon Shield Bypass, boarding, and all the upgrades we have, we should be in decent shape for the boss. Okay. I hope I get this repair just to not be at, you know, handicapped health going into the boss fight. You believe in us. That Sector 1 start was effing awful, and look at us now. Nice. Okay... If I take out piloting, I let this fire, I hack, I take out piloting, I can missile the shields. God, they don't even take out piloting. Is it level three? Oh god. Okay, oh, that's that hit. I fucking hate you, FTL. I okay, fucking good. hate you and your fucking bullshit. <laughs> I think that was the same one. That was that was a rough day. I'm pretty sure that was a really rough day there.
for that one. I'm pretty sure that was probably ending it. Well, that was probably ending a streak on that one. Uh, can we get max level artillery? Depending on how much scrap we get from these last couple of jumps, honestly. I won't try very hard, to be honest. I think the most satisfying thing about this run is that if it goes well as hoped, you won't have to do it again this streak. True. Very true. Alright, we got the repair. I might have to... I think I get there before he jumps away, I think. There, now that I have that power, I might actually invest into the artillery. Rand is now even cursing at FTL when he has a good run, thanks to RPG and his mod. That's right. Oh, yeah. Good. No dive going to the boss lane. Very good. All right, where does his hat go, first of all? Into my teleporter. Okay. You only have level two piloting, please. It's like yes, beautiful. No. Beautiful, safe fight. RPG is such a creative modder. You mean the mods concept is just absolutely brilliant? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know how uh, RPG is super super creative. If you've seen any of his viewership creations. Hey look, artillery helped. <laughs> RPG is just super duper creative. Alright, here we go. We go into the boss fight. We board into... Uh, who's our secondary boarding here, actually? Um, your engines... So these two guys are going to be secondary boarders. We go into Ion first, then Laser. We hack the missiles. Um, um, how do I want to do this? Yeah, we'll be able to get level 3 artillery next, but I don't want this on for the first phase. Um, for first phase, do I want any of these instead of one of these? Armories into the weapon, into the missile. One, two, three, four, five shots to try to get through four shields. Probably not happening. So, something like this, I guess. Already hacked just to prove it's worth this phase. Yes, yeah, so let's hope that they hack my artillery. That would be the best use of hacking this entire run. Although it did save me in that fight that I thought was going to kill us in the Ashwood field. But again, that's saving when, if we had anything but artillery, we would have been probably in not such a bad uh, bad position anyway. Okay, the teleporter hack's the work. Shield hack is bad. Do I need to run because of that hack? I think I might reset because of that hack. Because that means lasers can hit us like that shit right there. Fucking hell, what a bad start. Okay. We should have multiple reset opportunities if I... ...follow him. Eh, I might not get... God, they're taking... This is shitty uh, takeovers here. Okay, please don't... Weapon hack is fine. Not shields or teleporter. Or hacking, please. Okay, that's that's fine, although you're in a bad position, but that's okay. We want you over there and you over there, and you stay there. There's that. Take me a while to get through here to get my second boarding over here. Fuck 
you, Emilio. Fuck your shitty fucking face. Nice, man. nice. All right, fuck? we got over. We got over there. We're good. Now we should be good. We took two damage from the false start of phase one from the BS terrible hack of shields. But now we're looking good. I actually want them to put that fire out because then I can board and start killing them. Perfect. Beautiful. This will let us 2v1 him. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. Alright, well. Bring these guys back. I should have brought them back earlier. Got him. Okay, right before the uh, cloaking. Great. Get them cookies prep, that's right. Nice. Right, kill that guy, let those guys in. We fall, call phase ones that have bad hacks phase zero. Sure. Sure thing. I have a feeling I'm going to have to send these guys over again. That's fine, though. This should finish it. Well, he just went through the door. Ooh, that guy gets out. Okay, this will be annoying, but it's fine. Now you'll heal, then he'll come back. Let's get these guys ready to go into shields. Go. Do it now. Kill the... Uh, I was going to kill Cloaking. There it is. I'm not using missiles after this phase, so I can just use them. <laughs> That's the dodge sound. <laughs> Good. Fuck you, Beautiful. you fucking shitty game! Beautiful. And that should do it. Fuck you. Alright, beautiful. Fuck you, you cheating ass game. Alright. Now we can turn on artillery and just end the uh, fights as quickly as possible. Um, so we want four, three, two, one. This up, up two o two. Do I leave one guy to deal with the borders? No, this I'll I'll actually probably send two Zeltans to deal with the bo excuse me the borders, the boarding drone. All these guys kill the missiles, hack shields, try to do the good, do the good hull beam swipe, actually try to hull laser empty rooms. Um, we can turn on artillery one more level, I guess. Something like this, I think. All right, here we go. Wait for him to come back. Swipe there. Almost, but not quite. Nice! Zero damage phase two. Beautiful. Zero damage phase two. Very nice. 
Full lasering, empty rooms. Who are you and where is the real Rand? I probably, if I had gotten my, that whole beam swipe, uh, I don't have enough practice at it. It's another thing that I need to get better at. Uh, I, I probably would have killed him slightly quicker. All right, so we don't have the Zoltan shield. I mean, we don't have the mind control counter. So, Zoltan's all run into the clone bay here. Um, these guys, you run into there. So whoever doesn't get mind controlled of these three guys runs in the teleporter, gets into missiles, auto fire at the Zoltan shield. We don't need this online until we get through the Zeldon Shield. I think I got the swipe fine. I'm pretty sure I missed one part of it. I don't know. I think it was seven instead of nine, like Sleeping Dragon said. Optimal whole beam swipe is tricky to get, easy to miss in one of the empty rooms. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the room next to Heal Bay, I just barely missed it. But no big deal. Uh, 44. Look, we can get swiggity swaggity sensors. That's the only thing we can get. All right, let's go. Is there any benefit to, to waiting for the flagship rather than chasing it? You want to chase the flagship on phase three. You want to wait for it phase two, Hamosito. There's probably videos out there telling why you want to do each of those, and I'm not going to explain it right now. Sorry. Okay, so Kazak means we do this. All right, and I don't care about this, but I am going to vent you. Oh god, that's not great. Okay, you help repair that as you can. We're through. Uh, where are you going? I do not know why you were going that way. Okay, go on piloting. Okay, I think I got the swipe better that time. My control is not down, but it's weakened. Okay, that's fine. Let's get you guys there. Here comes the flak artillery. I'll use that to finish him. GG! That seat down, baby! Oh man, that feels good! GG cookie time, getting the fancy down, and with that start, oh, that feels like a good comeback right there. So stinking good to get that win. Fancy win, that is eight in a row now, right? Eight in a row. What's that score? 61-41. Wow. That turns out to be our second highest score on that ship. With that crazy start. Let's see what the uh, thing looked like here. Slug like Homeworlds was actually one of the less good scrap gains, but... Over two, 2,100 scrap. 375 free stuff. If it wasn't for jump one and jump two being terrifying, that would have been a really smooth Fed C run. But my friends, I'm going to call it a day there. Getting Fed C down is really, really nice. We'll do some more of this on Thursday. Like I said, tomorrow's going to be sort stream. For anybody who does come hang out for some WoW, I'll probably just play a little bit of leveling before having to head out to get ready for a gig. But as usual, hope you all had a good time. Thank you for those bits, Flurchin. Appreciate it. Um, I might this Friday check out Last Epoch on stream, depending on how much I enjoy it off stream and if I want to play it on stream, or I might just stick with a WoW. So, um, but uh, Thursday will be continuation of our attempts at this keeping the streak alive. So as usual, thank you all for all the support. Bits, follow subs, get the subs working, hanging out. If there's anybody new to the stream, I hope you had a fun time. And if you did, hit the follow. Come play again. Come play. Come play with us again. Come watch the stream again. So I hope you all have a great night. I'm going to go work out. So until next time, peace out. Happy gaming. Y'all have a great night. See you next time, my friends. Y'all rock.